Hi everyone, so today I'm going to be showing you how to use the Thai Milk Tea Instant Boba Kit from Amazon. It's from the company Flav Farm. It's really cool because you can make your own boba at home. It comes with five packages of each of the ingredients. Here is the condensed milk packages. And here are the five straws, boba straws. Here are five packages of the instant Thai tea mix. And the packages of instant microwavable or cookable, I dropped it, boba. Uh, you can put it in hot water as well, which is what I mean. So yeah, that's what the outer package looks like. So to start off with, uh, there are two different ways to make it on the back, but I'm doing it with, they say the preferred method is to first mix the instant Thai tea with the package of condensed milk. So you just put 6.8 ounces of hot water. Um, I used a measuring cup and I still went a little over. <laughs> so try to get it. I think less is better. That'll It'll have a stronger flavor if you use less water. Of course, it'll be more condensed. So I'm just cutting open the package of condensed milk, adding it to the instant Thai tea powder, and then I'm just making sure you're getting all of it out of the package. You can adjust your sweetness level is what it says on the package. I figured I'd just do the whole thing, just try it out first. Then I'm adding hot water uh, and mix it up. pretty good it's really easy to dissolve then I'm adding some I went ahead and microwaved the instant tapioca pearls the boba it says to cut a slit into the package uh, to let the hot air out or the heat out I'm not sure but I already microwaved it and it was pretty hot to the touch so be careful then I just went ahead and cut off the top and I went put it directly into the glass I was going to use and Again, I squeezed out all the extra brown sugar sauce syrup. It's so good. They're really good boba too. They taste so soft and they're super easy to make. So then from there, I just kind of stirred it around the glass so I could, so it could look like they do at the boba shops. And then I added the ice. And you want to put as much ice as your cup can hold especially if your if your tea is still kind of warm uh, i would recommend letting it sit for a while because i didn't and it watered down a little bit but i if i hadn't i bet it would have been super great but it was good either way so yeah that's what it looks like and then i just opened my boba straw of course putting the pointy side down as you all know i'm sure <laughs> and it was great it tasted super good I would definitely recommend it for anyone who is missing boba during quarantine or hasn't been able to go out and get any. It tastes just as good as the boba as the boba shops and the boba is super soft and delicious. So I would highly recommend this. Have a good day and don't forget to lick and subscribe. Princess.